All right, let's talk about how shitty Darman is. Get off me for a minute. Yeah, so here's his Instagram post. Thank God. So here he is once again with his family that works uh, family. for $12 an hour. The past week has been a roller coaster of emotions, he said. I'm saddened for those affected by everything going on and for the various misleading stories that have spread. What does he mean by those affected? Probably everybody that works with him. The doggies. Okay. <clears throat> I just met with some great actors who have been with us from the beginning. And we're all doing our best to get through this together in a respectful and positive way. It's like, you're, they're not going through it with you. No. They did, <laughs> they're not included. Right. This is about you, Darman. Also, you know he never meets with the actors. He goes, I just met with some great actors. But doesn't he say as much in like on the next slide? He does, yeah, yeah. he does. For those that don't know, there have been recent protests at our studio by a group of actors, many of whom we have not worked with in years. What? We tried to fact check that. Were we able to? I, did, I can't tell. I have a hard time thinking. I, I, I'm skeptical of this whole statement. Well, he says something coming up about how much he pays them that I feel like can be proven. Is very easily proven or disproven. So <laughs> that should give us some more information. So he says these protesters represent a small percentage of the thousand, bro, you, a thousand actors? You need to be regulated. Thousands. <laughs> thousands. <laughs> like, hello, this is bullshit. He's doing a legit production studio with none of the union, none of the regulations. Thousands, bro? With children, by the way. These protesters represent a small percentage of the thousands of actors we have and do not resent the views of all actors. Well, nothing does. I could say everyone I know hates your videos. Clearly, that's not everybody in the world. Wish it was. The protesters have said that I won't meet with actors and do not show up for a planned meeting. They said that they want to have like a negotiation with him. And that he won't do it? He wouldn't show up to talk to them. He stiffed okay. them and just made them talk to like HR. He kept giving them the runaround shit before they went public, they said. He says, that's not true. I love meeting with actors and talking to them whenever I am at the studio. That's like the, the I love meeting with <laughs> actors. I'm sure. And talking to them whenever I am at the studio. For example, when I pass, they are not allowed to look at me in the eye, but they can say hello. <laughs> but if there's ever a formal meeting request from an actor, the meeting usually starts with our head of production or our HR manager, not me personally. That's what they said. But okay. just to show you how corporate this shit is, he's like, yeah, no, I can't meet with you. You need to go through HR. Come on, bro. When the protesters requested a meeting, it was scheduled with our management team. It was never communicated that I would attend. During that meeting, the protesters did not communicate any concerns and instead walked out within a few minutes. That's not true. That can't be true. They just came in. And they, they just gave us a stink out. eye, and they were they spit on the ground. They they dumped over our trash cans and left. They never asked for anything. I hear chewing. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I think that that actually. Do have food out? Because I think he's. Oh, is it food? Okay, cool. Yeah. yeah. I think that that actually does line up with um, the report from the gentleman whose video we talked and played sounds yeah. over the entire time. Yeah. He said they had this meeting and they had set up the meeting to confront Darman and he didn't show up and so they said he needs to come or we're or we're leaving and and they left so I, I that does line up with what Darman is now saying dude Darman is a is a is a criminal the 2013 man was convicted of defrauding the city of Oakland through his real estate company <laughs> man edge property no I need details on that what <laughs> okay <laughs> that to me is a huge red flag this man bre breaded his butter by scamming Oakland City. Oh my God, City. it is him. Darminder Man. Darminder? <laughs> Here, I think that's just his full name. What? That's him, right? What a funny plot twist. Wait, this yeah, is from 2012. This yeah. is pre-Darman. And they, it was so egregious, they wrote an article about it. SFgate.com. Wow, new Darman lore just dropped. Holy shit. Hey, I got an idea for your next video. 
man defrauds entire city Fake in real check? estate scam. Bro. Did he go to jail? Warehouse, Warehouse scam? scam? Right. He has a prominent family. I think it was just probation. Uh, probation. Leading face of the medical marijuana industry. Let's go. Huh? In reality, you guys got scammed. Also, he, it seems like he's well-connected, which got him off. Man and has cultivated close ties to city councilwoman Desley Brooks. 2010, he opened a school, University of Cannabis. Are you fucking kidding me? University of Cannabis? He, call, he opened a school. That's what I'm talking about. He opened a school called University of Cannabis. That's I'm so fucking cool. enrolling tomorrow, baby. <laughs> Dan, you want to be my study buddy? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Let's, let's, get, let's, get, let's get roomies in the dorm. Hey, dude. man. We yeah, got a man on the phone. Let's we've go. got credentialed, tenured professors at best, University I, best of Cannabis. Best buds, dude. Best buds. Why am I talking about enrolling? I need to be a professor. You, dude. yeah. Hey, yeah, Dan. Ten school. <laughs> Let's get tenure. Maybe all of his. Hey, hey, professor. What's the optimal temperature to hit a vape at? Hey, Dan. You gonna be enrolling later? Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey, maybe all of his actors are like his old customers. There's, um, let me make that. sure that this was not retracted like a certain other article. Yeah. <laughs> I'm uh, seeing, before we go any further. Yeah, I'm seeing. <laughs> I'm seeing the editor's notes on a few. Article saying that he paid the fine and was re released early from probation. So okay, so I mean, there's no contradiction. He paid the fine. Uh, he did the crime. He paid the fine. You know, it's all good. We we believe in rehabilitation in this house. That was the crime. That's crazy though, because he. Okay, so there you go. He's not this. I mean, that's not saint-like behavior. Given the unsuccessful meetings, we asked they put their concerns in writing so we could address them. Instead, they came to our studio to disrupt productions, causing stress to crew members and actors. Yeah, I'm sure they were really stressed out. Certain protesters even spread false information to hurt the studio, my family, and me. That's the reason why I have not met with these individuals. I thought you already passed before any of that happened. I would also like to address the misinformation being spread by protesters that we don't pay our actors. Okay. This is one. First of all, nobody claimed that. Nobody mm -hmm. claimed he doesn't pay them. Mm -hmm. so that's kind of a little trick he played there. This is 100% not true. We always pay actors for any work they perform, including TikToks where they pretend to like me. <laughs> we don't have any full-time actors. We offer project-based opportunities. This is a standard practice in the production and acting industry. All details, including pay rate and length of production, are specified in the offer letter, and the actor has freedom to accept or decline the project. If accepted, actors are paid within 72 hours after a production wraps. Our current... I mean, that's such a... Why are you even making that point? We don't force them at gunpoint to work for us. Yeah. Like, yeah, no, of course not. Yeah. That, you can say that about really anything. It's really scummy. It's really scummy. <laughs> they could say no. Right. That's not really the point. Yeah, not not. If accepted, they just... They want better wages. It's just like a protest. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. we're pro-union around here. That's right. It's not for you guys. Yeah, it seems like his whole statement is just kind of like re rewarded in a way that for dum dums would sound good. Right. If accepted, actors are paid within 72 hours after production. And then he says, our current rate for actors with speaking roles are 33 to 44 dollars. Now, that's not bad, mm -hmm. but he no, says, that's... our current rate. So I would like to know. And actors with speaking roles. It's a little bit of weasel, weasel word there. Current. Current yeah. rate. Yeah. yeah. But that was the part that I was referring to e earlier. That is so easily proven or disproven. Just do one of the actors that are protesting just show a pay stub. That's what I want. I want someone the to hourly show rate. me. Because what's, let's say, 33. Because by 33 to 44, he means 33. <laughs> right. <laughs> so what's 33 times uh, 8? Crunch those numbers for me. Hardcore. 264, uh, but you know, with acting, it, it's generally generally understood that it's going to be a 10 hour day, uh, which is technically two hours of OT uh, at time and a half, so it would be eight hours at 33. Mm -hmm. And then Cross carry that, carry the two, three times 1.5 times two, <laughs> carry the five plus <laughs> divide by seven. <laughs> Multiply by 365. Uh, so that's uh, 363 a day for a I feel like there's day. no way he's paying them that. Yeah, which still isn't a ton of money. But Did we I mean, try reaching out reasonable. to this guy? I want to I get the facts. The guy on TikTok? 
I bet you'd talk to us. I can. Yeah, yeah reach out. That's All right. right. I want to see a pay stub. Let's just end this right now. <laughs> the if, man we called so boring. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I don't well, know if no, he... I'm here. Listen, I'm <laughs> on his side. He checked out the video. He might not. I'm on his side. He's just not great at making videos. You know? <laughs> it's a skill you can get better at. <laughs> I'm sympathetic, but fuck, that was a boring video. <laughs> yeah, reach out to him. <laughs> It means I don't, it doesn't mean I don't like him as a person. <laughs> I understand. Yeah, no, you're just yeah. He's just not used to. He's not a content creator. As I said, in two and a half years working here, that was the hardest video I had to watch. Uh, yes. Gre Greta Jane says the actor said they get uh they get paid only two hours of the day. I mean, whoa. Yeah, again, it, it's what two hours. I'm, I'm leaning towards uh him being full of shit, but. It's yeah. just by 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 actually giving a firm statement about how much he pays, that makes it very easy to work out whether or not uh, he's telling the truth. If he was really paying people three hundred plus per day rate, I don't think there'd be any problems. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, That's, I don't think there would be paying for two hours. Something here doesn't make sense. Yes. So he says, uh, while I'm taking the steps, stop the spread of misinformation. I, he's implying he's going to sue them. I think Logan Paul style. I do acknowledge that there's always opportunity for me to grow. Oh, thank you. So today in my meeting with actors, oh, he met with the actors. <laughs> These are the nice ones, by the way. <laughs> we came up with ways to improve such thing as more efficient booking system. Bitch, they want more money. Stronger communications and more consistent hours and pay. These changes are now in motion. So the protests worked. <laughs> I don't know what that means. My mission on why I started this channel has always been to spread positivity. Anyway, yeah, after I defrauded the, the, the city of Oakland, I wanted to make this channel to spread positivity. After writing fake checks and defrauding the city of Oakland, <laughs> I really wanted to spread some love. Although this has been a challenging time, I'm never going to stop working hard towards that goal. I do ask to please stop with any negative comments, especially towards actors, regardless of their views. Bro, I don't care about the actors. I mean, I do. I want the best for them. <laughs> I'm so thankful for all the love and support. Dar, man. I gotta know. We gotta get to the bottom of this. Yeah, well, Olivia will reach out um, to our friend, friend of the show. Um, <laughs> and Best friend, we love his content. We love shit. everything he does. Yeah, again, it's just like it, it, with, with whoa, him putting whoa. that information out there, it, it makes it very easy to confirm or deny. Who's Bro, first of all, he's sitting with Jay Shetty, so there's your first strike. Yeah, so they, they, they are, they together. do have a podcast together. Scum, oh. dude. I'm telling you, the fucking rats, they congregate, <laughs> they attract each other. Rats, I, I, I bet so you I know where, uh, I know where Jay Shetty got that $20 smoothie idea from. Mm -hmm. He's got a like a fussy two beard line going. Looks Jeez. artificial, doesn't it? A little bit, yeah. He's probably yeah. just lined up. He's just lined up. You think he's just, just lined up? up? Yeah. I, I want to hear what they're saying. I want to hear if it's interesting or if it makes me hate them more. Bottom right corner. Muted in the bottom right corner. Oh shit. By being the bigger person, I'm carrying that with me now yeah, for, sure. for the rest of my life when that person is gonna stay stagnant in their place. When we, in our most vulnerable moments, can admit that we could have done something better, it's not that the other person. Dude, you just had the opportunity to do that. Is that a new video or is that This is role? from 12 weeks ago. Okay, so. Before the conference. Well, yeah, but he prophesized <laughs> that he that. would not rise to the occasion. It's, right. It's that you win, right? Mm -hmm. Because ultimately, you're becoming the better version of yourself that you want to be. Not every relationship is meant to last forever. Some people are only going to be in your life temporarily, right? And that Like my actors, for example. They come and they go. All right, That's sorry. okay. But if I... I don't care. Because they're boring. <laughs> not funny at all. Starman is like the least funny person. <laughs> That's all I.